What's up, football fans? Kevin Smith with you of the call sheet. Doing a quick little feature here that we're calling Call Sheet Shorts. I'm going to give you two to three minutes on one of the hot topics in the NFL and in the offseason. Right now, all the talk seems to be about quarterbacks. And today's topic will be on why the Atlanta Falcons should trade for Chicago Bears quarterback Justin Fields. All right, the Falcons finished seven and nine a year ago. In the NFC South, that'll put you pretty close to the top. They're only two games away from the top of the division, the Tampa Bay Bucks. Atlanta's a, got a talented roster on offense, man. They've got great running backs, Bijan Robinson, Tyler Algier, a stud tight end in Kyle Pitts, uh, an elite receiver in Drake London, a top 10 offensive line for the PFF rankings. They're a quarterback away from being a pretty potent offense and being really a, a challenger in that NFC South. And that quarterback should be Justin Fields. Some talk about maybe that the Falcons pursuing a Kirk Cousins, but in the new offense that's likely to be installed by Zach Robinson, who was just brought over from the Rams, former passing coordinator with the Rams, now going to be the OC in Atlanta. That's a, that's a Sean McVay style offense. And, and it relies a lot on play action, on pocket movement, bootlegs. Justin Fields is a great fit for that. He's a guy whose athleticism will complement the young athletes in Atlanta already. A guy who, who fits really well in Robinson's system. And just 24 years old, Justin Fields has a big future ahead of him. This is a young Falcons team, man. They're going to be building for the future, though with an eye on contending right now in that weaker NFC South. Kirk Cousins, 35, almost 36 years old, coming off an Achilles. He's probably got some great football left in him, but I don't necessarily see it in this particular style of an offense. So it would be a great move on the Falcons' part to bring home the Georgia boy, man, Justin Fields. Raheem Morris, the new head coach, just said it the other day. He said, we want to pursue a quarterback who fits this city. That was an interesting word he used, this city. Not this franchise, this city. I think Justin Fields will have a huge amount of support if he comes home to his home state of Georgia. He originally went to the Georgia Bulldogs before transferring to Ohio State, and he's a great fit in that offense. All right, last thought. What would it take to get Justin Fields? They could probably get him for a second-round pick. The Falcons hold – Hold the first round pick at number eight. Their second round selection is number 43. Grabbing Fields uh, for that second pick would not cost them that valuable first round pick. If they were to move up, let's say, to into the top two or three to try to grab a Drake May or a Jalen Daniels, they would no doubt have to part with that first round pick at number eight. This way they can stay at number eight, maybe dr grab an edge rusher like Dallas Turner of Alabama. They really need help rushing the passer, and then part with that second-round pick for Fields. That's a gamble worth taking, and it's one that the Falcons should make. All right, Kevin Smith with you for Call Sheet Shorts. We'll be back with some, some new thoughts shortly. Take care, everybody.